Today, we're talking about Bitcoin and its price action. There's been a lot of hype about BTC reaching a new all-time high, but according to a recent article on Cointelegraph, there are three key signs that Bitcoin might not quite be ready for that big leap just yet. So let's break down these signs, chat about what they mean, and take a look at what people are saying. All right, let's jump into the first sign that Bitcoin's price may not be ready to hit a new all-time high declining trading volumes. Volume is one of the biggest indicators of market strength. And right now, it seems like Bitcoin's trading volume just isn't supporting a strong upward move. Think of it this way. For a rally to be sustainable, you need a lot of buying power behind it. The more people buying and trading BTC, the more momentum it has. But lately, trading volumes have been dropping, suggesting that the buying interest just isn't there yet. Without this strong support, it's going to be tough for Bitcoin to climb and stay above these high levels. The second sign to watch out for is the decrease in whale activities. Uh, whales, those big investors holding huge amounts of Bitcoin, uh, play a major role in the market moves. When whales start buying, it usually triggers a surge in the price. But right now, it looks like whale activity has been on the decline. This suggests that big players might be sitting on the sidelines waiting for a better opportunity, and they're simply not as bullish as they were before. And if the whales aren't buying in, it's a good indication that a major price rally might not be on the horizon just yet. All right, now for the third sign, lower institutional interest. Institutions uh, like hedge funds, asset managers, and even publicly traded companies have been huge drivers of Bitcoin's price rallies in the past. Remember the big hype when companies like MicroStrategy and Tesla announced that they were adding Bitcoin to their balance sheets? Yeah, those were some good times for BTC. But recently, we haven't seen the same level of institutional interest. There are still players in the game, but it's not at the fever pitch that it was during the last bull run, which uh, with less uh, institutional money flowing into BTC, the market might be lacking the fuel it needs to push the price into new all-time highs. So what's the buzz on social media about this? Well, it's definitely a mix of, um, uh, of opinions and emotions. Over on X and Reddit, there are some who are taking a more cautious approach, agreeing that without strong volumes, whale activity and institutional interest, it's going to be tough for Bitcoin to reach new all-time highs. They're saying it might be time to hold off on the moon talk until these indicators start to look better. But of course, there are always some diehard BTC bulls who aren't phased at all. They're saying it's only a matter of time and that any dip is just another buying opportunity to buy more before the next big rally. The optimism is real. And if there's one thing that uh, stays consistent on constant in crypto is that Bitcoin community is always full of of surprises. So what should you be watching for in the coming days and weeks? Keep an eye on these trading volumes. If they start to pick up, that could be a good sign for a potential price rally. Also, watch for any big news from whales or institutional players. If we start to uh, start seeing these bit, big BTC buys, uh, that could signal that the market is gearing up for a move. And most importantly, don't let FOMO, the fear of missing out, cloud your judgment. Just because the market is quiet right now doesn't mean mean it's going to explode later on. Patience and staying informed are absolutely key. It looks like Bitcoin might not quite be ready for a new all-time high just yet, but it doesn't mean that the rally isn't coming. It just, uh, uh, just might take a little bit longer. What do you think? Uh, do, do you think that we are due for a push upwards soon, or are we going to see more sideways movements for a while? Drop your thoughts in the comments down below, or join us in our free Discord server. We would love to hear from you. If you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe, tap that bell so you never miss another update. And if you haven't done so already, guys, check this video out right here. It's not one you're going to want to miss.